Britain's Got Talent might just be about to get its first ever comedian winner in Sunday night's final, although the show's only remaining dance troupe could still cause an upset. Because according to the betting it's currently a race to the title between Funnyman Lost Voice Guy and Robert White, with Lost Voice Guy currently at in front. The 37-year-old, Aka comedian Lee Ridley, who had everybody in hysterics on Monday night's show, has been among the favorites all week, and while things have been changing at the top of the betting in recent days he's currently narrowly ahead in the betting at seven-fourths, that puts him ahead of previous favorite White, although at nine-fourths he definitely can't be ruled out for the win. And it's just possible that the comics could miss out following the surge from dance troupe DVJ, who following their win on Thursday night's show are now just 5-1 to be crowned 2018 champions, or fellow comedian Mickey P. Kerr, who's now a 10-1 shot after winning Friday's semi-final. It's been a year for comedians so far and Lost Voice Guy is the favorite to win tonight's show and be the first comic to ever win the show said Coral's Harry Aitken head. However the standard and drama has been so great that we can't rule out a number of acts gaining glory tonight. Mickey Kerr was a landslide winner in his semi-final, and even DVJ who were as big as 21 earlier in the week could be crowned winners with an exciting night ahead. Ahead of Sunday night's show here is how the betting is currently looking, Lost Voice Guy 7 fourths. Lost Voice Guy, who is unable to speak due to complications from cerebral palsy, and delivers his material through a voice synthesizer, secure his place in the final, after delivering more brilliantly self-deprecating humor in the first live show. Just one more routine stance between him and the series title, can he pull it off? Robert White 9 fourths. Nobody saw this coming, but comedian Robert White delivered such a spot on performance on Wednesday night, leaving the audience and judges howling as he called Amanda Holden old and suggested Alesha Dixon dressed like a hooker that he is now the second favorite to win the whole darn competition. Is Britain's Got Talent about to crown a comedian champion? DVJ 51.DVJ, Aka Diversity Juniors, are the only remaining dance troupe in the competition and are now one of the favorites to win after Thursday night's barnstorming performance. Could they be about to follow in the footsteps of their senior counterparts nine years after they triumphed? Mickey P. Kerr 10-1. Robert White and Lost Voice Guy might be nabbing a lot of attention for their comedy turns, but we shouldn't rule out fellow funnyman Mickey P. Kerr, who's jumped up to fourth favorite after the quirky, hilarious performance which won him Friday night's final, complete with that song about Andy Murray's mum. Gruffet win Robert's 12-1. Could opera win Britain's Got Talent this year? Well, it's certainly possible, as Amanda's golden buzzer act Gruffet whose Ness and Dorma won him an automatic pass to the finals, nabbed his place in the grand final on Wednesday after being voted through by the judges. He's still very much in the running for this. The D-Day Darling 16 1.3 Brothers 21. The acrobatic sibling duo were the final act to be voted through to the final after finishing second in Friday night's show, and it's no surprise to see them there after their daredevil antics literally left us all gasping. Just how will they up the ante in the final, and could they be the surprise winners? Jack and Tim 33 won. The father-son singing duo, Simon Cowell's golden buzzer act, were previously one of the favorites to take the crown, but have slipped back slightly in the betting despite making it through Thursday night's semi-final. Let's not count them out just yet though, because they're still a joy to watch on stage. 
Donches Dassers 51. David Williams' Golden Buzzer Act was crowned the winner of Tuesday night's semi final, but is considered an outsider for the title. Whether the bookies prove accurate or he can pull off a surprise, that doesn't mean he's not thoroughly entertaining to watch. Callum Courtney 101. This year's youngest finalist, 10 year old Callum, was voted through to the finals from Tuesday night's show after charming them with a reworked version of Stevie Wonder's Isn't She Lovely, dedicated to his mom. Can he overcome the odds and deliver a surprise on Sunday night? Britain's Got Talent 2018's grand final kicks off at 7.